having a love for animals is common, but for some it drives their decisions and their life. And that's exactly what Becky Hacker has done. She's devoted her life to caring for animals, dogs in particular. TV6's Blair Caldwell has an up-close look at how she turned her passion into a career. Becky spent 20 years of her life as a veterinary technician. The last 12 of those years, she has worked specifically with sled dogs at about 31 different races. A friend of mine was the chief veterinarian uh, for the John Bear Grease, and uh, he said, hey, Beck, I think you might like this. And I said, well, all right, I'll give it a shot, and I've uh, been with the dogs ever since. It didn't take her long to decide she wanted to try out mushing for herself. She loves the purpose it gives the dogs and the energy surrounding a race. They're happy. They love what they do. They um, it's a positive energy. If you've never been to a, a sled dog race, I highly recommend you go to the start because it's just, it, it's amazing. And um, uh, even now I'm getting goosebumps just thinking about it. Becky trade a life of comfort in Minnesota for a cabin and sled dogs. It's a decision she says was well worth it. For me, there was something missing um, and I finally found it. I, I, yeah, I can't even explain it. I, it's just there. It's my life, and I, I absolutely love it. Once Becky bought her first dog, she soon had 14. She also looks after her mentor Al Hardman's dogs for a total of 35 Alaskan Huskies. She will use a mixture of Hardman's dogs and hers for the UP200. The dogs, I think, are ready. I, myself, I'm, I'm ready. I think I can do it. My only goal is to finish in the daylight on Sunday. I, uh, I want to finish with happy dogs. She's using the UP200 as a qualifier for the Iditarod. And although she has a lot of lists to check off before Friday's race, she and her team are ready to go. I have pretty high expectations, and I'm really excited to see how they do. Blair Caldwell, TV6 News, McMillan.